Back in the days, I want to say most guys initiate the flirting, but I could be totally wrong since I wasn't born in the 1930s. Nowadays, it's equal. Kinda. Girls flirt all the time. You just have to be around enough girls to see them in action. Unfortunately, I don't have the pleasure to do that. The closest thing to that is having four posters of my favorite anime characters in all four corners of my room. Of course, at least six feet apart. But that doesn't mean I don't have this one female friend who's always flirting and going on dates more than I go out my room. So I give her a call and gather my intel with her and ask her the question. So how do girls flirt? And after three hours of note taking and some undeletable visual images in my mind, here are the 10 things girls do to flirt. Number one, flirting with her mouth. If she's baring her teeth, step away. If she's smiling, you've got some flirting going on. It's important to note that her smile should be consistent. Smile at you once, she's generally approachable. Smile at you twice, she's being extra nice. Smile at you three times, get a conversation going and keep it going because this girl could be into you. If she gives you an air kiss, you should already know where that's going. Give her one right back. Also, be on the lookout if she uses a softer or maybe a high pitched tone with you when compared to her regular voice. If so, then she's trying to flirt. Number two, flirting with her appearance. You know, when you see her, she's always looking nice and good, makeup all done, hair on point, and outfit is stunning, maybe showing some ankles or shoulders. <laughs> you know, the look, the seductive look. If she's slowly walking towards you, you already know she's doing this so you can check her out. You'll know she's flirting if she ends up talking to you. The most common starter question would be, What's up? So be on the lookout for that. Number three, through competition. Some girls love a good competition because it's playful. This works great when you two find something you both like, like a shared hobby. She might challenge you with a real competition like a sport or a mental competition with a bet. And fair warning, this girl doesn't expect you to let her win. It's just to get close to you and have something to do instead of just awkwardly talking. It's all fun and games until she ends up winning and your ego loses like 50 experience points. Number four, flirting with touch. Now, this could go rated R really quick, but let's keep it PG. Any touches on your arms, back, hands, legs are all good indicators. If she's more confident, she'll jam her hands through your hair like she's combing it. At that point, you know it's real flirting if someone does that. Sucks if you have really short hair because then she won't have the opportunity to do that. Oh yeah, you can't forget about those random massages. Yep, but on the other hand, if she's the polite one, she may touch her own face, neck, arm, or just be playing with her hair. This shows that she's open around you. Number five, flirting with gifts. These aren't usually like big gifts or anything expensive, although that would be nice. If that happens, then you know they already like you enough to spend a lot of money on you. But I'm talking about the small gifts, or treats perhaps. You know, if she gets you coffee while she's passing by her favorite coffee place, or even buying you some snacks for your lunch, you'll notice she'll be all cute and sweet with you when she hands it to you. When that happens, she's flirting with you. Number six, flirting with her eyes. General staring is kind of creepy and uncomfortable. No one likes being watched, that's why we have blinds for our windows. More lighthearted looks though is definitely a safe way and fun way to flirt. Girls have a knack for doing this through flirtatious looks, especially by looking at you, looking away, and then looking back at you. You'll be able to tell if they are flirting with you through their eyes by just acknowledging their eyebrows. If they move like the waves or just lift it high, then she's trying to get your attention. Number seven, flirting with laughter. Most of the time you'll see shy girls do this because then the girl doesn't have to talk. Sometimes girls could get really shy and likes hearing the stories or jokes you tell and they could just simply respond back with a laughter. That's just how she likes to express her feelings to you. But non-shy girls could easily do this too, laughing out loud with their mouth wide open and face turning red. That's when you know you're on a roll. Number eight, flirting through likes. Nowadays, you could probably say that there's a good chunk of relationship that are formed online. And there's a way to flirt online too. Emojis are the typical way to go, but there are more ways girls make their presence known online. I'm talking specifically about likes on social media. If a girl likes each and every one of the pics you post, there's some flirting going on. If she goes on a stalking and liking spree of your older posts, she's stepping it up to the next level of flirting. Be looking out for those comments as well as she will tease you or roast you in the comments section. 
Number nine, flirting by walking away. This one is big if you're in a group setting or at a public event. She's sort of subtly trying to pull you away so it's not too apparent. A girl will want to see if you're as interested in her as she is in you. So she may walk away from the group to see if you'll join her. This way, she'll have you all to herself without other people or girls around. She won't go far making sure that she stays in your line of vision. And if you walk towards her, then it's working. Number 10, flirting by teasing you. If she steals your lunch money or calls you really mean names, then that's not flirting. If she teases you with light jokes or slowly roasts you, but in a playful way, then she's definitely flirting. Girls will keep it humorous and make fun of you a bit to see how you react. If you play along, all goes well. If you take offense or respond negatively, she will steer clear of it because at the end of the day, girls just want to have fun. So no need to tense up. After hearing this, maybe she hasn't given you any berries or snacks, but you've been teased, smiled, touched, and liked on social media. Hey, those are all pretty good signs, but the real question is that is she doing this often with you? Keep your eyes for more of these signs and see for yourself. It's always good to flirt back when they initiate. I'm just saying. Anyway, let me know how it goes, and if you like this video, feel free to give it a like and maybe consider subscribing for more videos like these. And as always, thanks for watching.